Everyone told me to go see this, and I was pleasantly surprised. Hey, I'm Amy, and welcome or welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing some catch-up. Actually, the entire month of March, I'm going to be doing some catch-up reviews. The first one I'm going to be talking about is Fighting With My Family. It is the movie about WWE superstar Paige, I think. I don't know anything about WWE, but... The great thing about this movie is that it kind of got me wanting to check some of it out. It also has Stephen Merchant in it for a brief second, and Nick Frost plays the dad, and The Rock has a cameo, and Vince Vaughn is in this as well, so it's a pretty big cast, and The Rock helped produce this as well. So that's kind of one of the reasons I was planning on going to see this anyways, because if you have been on this channel for a while, you know I love The Rock. I will go see almost any movie he makes, maybe not Fast and Furious, but I love pretty much every single one of The Rock's movies, even if it's a bad one. Case in point, Rampage and Skyscraper. I love both of those movies and they're terrible. But this one was not terrible and I absolutely enjoyed it. Stephen Merchant wrote, I believe he wrote, I believe he wrote it and he also directed it and he did such a great job. He blends the family aspect with the sports aspect very well. It has a lot of heart and emotion, but also a lot of just drama and comedy. And it's a very well-rounded movie for a sports movie, especially a sports movie about WWE, which I know literally nothing about besides John Cena and The Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin. Yeah, I think that's it. So that's about the extent of my WWE knowledge. I did not grow up watching it. I don't watch it now, but you know, maybe I might. I don't know. That is what is great about some sports movies is that a lot of the times it will get you interested in a sport you never thought you had interest in before. And if it's a good sports movie, that's what it does. Actor-wise, I love the main girl who played Paige slash Brittany slash I don't quite remember what her actual name is. I just remember her stage names, even though they called her by her real name most of the time, especially her family. But Nick Frost was hilarious and... I mean, Stephen Merchant only had a couple very small parts, but he was great as well. And The Rock, of course, was amazing because I love The Rock. He can do no wrong in my eyes. And Vince Vaughn was Vince Vaughn, but I mean, I liked what his character did for the story. The story overall, it made me tear up in a lot of places. I did not think I would tear up in a movie like this. Oh, there's an airplane. I did not expect to tear up in this. I think I actually started kind of having a tear or two leak out at the very, very end because, I mean, this is a based on a true story. I don't know how much of it is true. I still have, I want to and haven't had the chance yet to, to go back and watch Paige's first WWE match out of NXT, her diva... Diva Championship? I, I don't remember what it's called, but that is something I kind of maybe possibly will want to get into because the, the way that they did the fighting was very cool and very interesting. They incorporated it very well into the story. It's not purely about wrestling. It's about a family of wrestlers, and it's really about the way they connect as a family and the way that their family kind of supports each other and their struggles throughout their lives and I thought that this did a really great job of that. I know some people went into it wanting just all about wrestling but that's not what this is. It's literally titled Fighting With My Family. She fights with her family. She has fun with her family. She fights for her family. It's it's a great story. It's a It's got some heart. It's got some emotion and it's got some laughs. So I mean this is a very short review but that's pretty much everything that I wanted to talk about. I have very short notes. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, I don't really have that much left to say. So overall, my rewatch score on this, I probably would not add it to my collection unless it was like on sale. So I would give this a red box. I would definitely rewatch this again and I would spend some money to rewatch it, not just 
whatever I pay for Netflix, but I don't think I would spend a lot of money to purchase this on Blu-ray. So yeah, let me know what your thoughts on Fighting With My Family are in the comments down below. Did you enjoy this or did you expect more of a wrestling story versus a family story? Some little bit of drama comedy in there. But anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really, truly do appreciate every single one of you. Let me know who you are in the comments down below and let's be friends. If you enjoyed this, leave a like and subscribe if you're new because I have talking about these movies, TV shows, filmmaking, film history, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye!